Okay, so this is the attack from Cuba, which is down here, to the U.S., and from Russian missiles. See how, see how devastating that was. You probably ruin it. Okay, so this is the attack on Russia from the Americans' missiles, which are in Turkey, which is somewhere around here. Wow. The thing fell. Out. Wasn't that terrible? So this is another attack on Russia on our major city, Leningrad which is right here from, again, in Turkey, which is around here. Woohoo! It's not lighting. Oh no! My city is burning. Okay, so this bag here represents the atmosphere, and the Earth is the Earth. And this light here, it represents the sun, you see how it's hitting the Earth and warming it up. Um, so this demonstration is going gonna, is gonna to be what could have happened had there been a large-scale nuclear war at the height of the Cold War. Um, yeah. It's your coin. So as you can see, smoke is covering and filling up the atmosphere, and the sun can no longer reach the Earth which would stop it from getting heated up and the whole earth would eventually get really cold and a lot of things would die including trees and people and animals and then it would all be really bad isn't this magical hey take the bag off Let's see the smoke come out huh. hey keep recording are you still recording? Yep. See the whole world is burning and smoke's pouring out of it? Right out of the ass. <laughs> that would be bad. <laughs> no, Antarctica's gone. And that's basically what nuclear winter is. And that's what could have happened had there been a large scale nuclear war. This is Ryan. Hi. And this is the moon.